Apple Cross. Yes. It's been a pleasure. Yes, Apple Cross campsite is the bomb. Bye. If you want. Oh, so this is basically going to be our view. We're basically following the coast all day today. So we've got 230 miles of this. And the and roads if, are going to be exactly like this. And well. if the weather's like this, what a difference. Oh, I really, I'm praying it stays like this. Look at this view. Cliff side to side, beautiful sea view, mountains in the distance. Be, in fact, that will be over somewhere. One of those things that you can see on the other side will be the Isle of Skye. What a change in weather from yesterday. Yeah, it's not too hot. No, it's perfect. It's, um, My trip says it's about 60. Oh, someone's house. Scotland is a beautiful place to live, it's just... Can you imagine if you lived there? I'll just pop it out to the shop, alright, see you next week. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit... You've got a cow with horns and you're riding a red motorcycle. Yeah, I know, but look, they don't give a shit, do they? No, I'm stuck. <laughs> oh. Right, bro. It's so fluffy. The audio is horrendously crackly. Go on, touch it, touch it. Go on, you're so close. If you don't touch, touch it, you're a pussy. Should I touch it? They're not even big. Go on. No. Go on, touch that one on the arse. Just give it a slap. What are you Getting off. Why? Go and say hello. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Yeah, no, weird. bro. Oh, I've fallen off a motorcycle already. Oh, this is scary. Yeah, it's not to do yeah it, no, you know. no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't know. Every time he, I, you can get close, but every time you touch it, he kind of like wobbles his head. Bye. Side stand. So cool. Rather larger. Hmm. so peaceful just rolling around this at like 30 miles an hour just taking in the views car every like three or four no not even that like five seven minutes or something like that ten miles no we've only met one we're going along here for half an hour myself off the barrier. No side stand needed. There we go. Look at it!
Nice quiet spot for a blueberry muffin. Hmm. Where are we now? Hmm? Where are we? Middle of nowhere. No On idea. On our way to Gerlock. Let's do that way, better son. No. And that road between Kinlock U, terrible pronunciation, no doubt, and where we are now, is the best road. It's really good, and it's the dry. The most fun road we've ridden so far, especially in the dry. We're pinning it. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Got some speed going. Got some confidence back in the corners. Didn't drop it, the important thing. <laughs> Always a bonus. <laughs> So the uh, reason I had to have bought that little, that fun little uh, filming trip is coming up the straight at a very reasonable speed. Fuel gauge was flashing on the last dash and it just sort of went, yeah, no, I've had enough. I've just given Charles a text, uh, requested some petrol. So he's going to be here in a couple of minutes. Obviously we, uh, we've got our jerry cans. But yeah, not a bad spot to run out of petrol, probably the nicest spot. I've ever run out of petrol to be quite honest. Um, so yeah, just wait for Charles. There he is. So we'll just uh, pop in there, throw a couple of litres in the old engine. Um, I, I, obviously, like I said, I think we did do this on, intentionally. Um, and to be honest, if I hadn't done that little bit of filming, we probably would have quite easily made it to Gerlock, which is our next stop. Uh, where we would have filled up with fuel without running dry. The Highland version of the AA. There he is, 10 litres of liquid gold. Right then, so the bike is refuelled and now we're going to head off to Gerlock, or Gerloch, which was supposed to be the fuel stop. And then from there, it's basically carry on all the way to Ullapool, and then Ullapool all the way to Durnas, where we're staying tonight. Let's go. Sweet. Sounds great. Oh, well done. You've really done that well. This one was really squashed. <laughs> Why is that mine now? 
God's sake. Why is that I'm going to use it with my fingers and do it better than you. Go on then. One of them was alright. Is the other one that was a bit squished. Look. Yes, look. Observe. Yeah, that one didn't go so well. Just made it to uh, Durness campsite. Okay. My range has been zero for the last 10 miles, no doubt due to my amorous use of the right hand. <laughs> yeah, my fuel gauge is on, I don't know how long. This, the screen's dead, so who knows? Decent spot for a campsite, bit crowded, but never mind. Today we followed the normal route of the North Coast 500 from Applecross to Durness and there will be more information in the description.